eternity. It extends to that place where we'll be able to have that blessed hope of being with you. And so, God, we thank you that you are able to speak through them. Thank you that in the midst of something that could cave in life, that they have uh, demonstrated what it means to have a faith that conquers. Because you, Jesus, conquered death. You conquered sin. You conquered the grave. You conquered evil. And you are in the process of setting that right. And one day you will say, it is finished. It is done. And you will come and you will reign victoriously. And at that time you've told us that there will be no more pain. There will be no more sorrow. There will be no more death. That all of those things will be put away. And that indeed we will be like you because we will see you as you are. And we will be in your presence. Until that time, God, give us the kind of faith that sustains. Give us the kind of faith that doesn't give up. Give us the kind of faith that is able to take on the really, really hard stuff and say that our hope is in Jesus Christ. And he does not fail. Lord, those points where we doubt, thank you that you forgive us. Thank you that you pick us up, you dust us off. Thank you that you are patient with us, as Wayne has said. And that we can know, we can know that you always, always, always love us. And that indeed there is nothing that can separate us from the love of God. And as Paul said, God, if you are for us, who can be against us? ALS can't be against us. Cancer can't be against us. All kinds of disease can't be against us. God, the struggles of life, they can't be against us because you can work through those. And so as we close this service today, we thank you that you have smiled upon us and given us the opportunity to be able to have this special message shared with us, to be challenged, to be encouraged, to be motivated, however it is that your spirit stirs us today. We give you the praise today. Help us to guard our relationship with you. Help us to guard our relationship with our loved ones. Help us to guard our relationships with our friends, our brothers and sisters in Christ. God, help us to keep short account to forgive and to be forgiven, and really to model the love of Jesus. It is in his name and for his glory that we pray. Amen. Praise God.